Hey everybody, are you a mixing station user and are you wondering how to reset your layout back to the default? Well, I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Let's go. If you're not new to mixing station, you probably don't need this video, but for those of you who are new to the app, if you've maybe been messing around with creating your own layout or you've edited a layout that was already there and now you can't get back to the original, this is how you're gonna do it. Before we start, I'm gonna say, this will delete any layouts you've made. So if you don't want to lose your layouts, you're gonna have to back them up. Back them up to the cloud if you can. Um, otherwise, just be warned, this is going to remove all your layouts. So what you're gonna do is you're going to come up to the settings cog and you are going to go to the layouts button. And then up here in the right corner, there's a little uh, circle back button, which looks like it's an undo button. And I guess it sort of is because it undoes all of your layouts. So if you click on that, it's gonna bring up a little box asking if you wanna remove your layouts and you're gonna say yes. And then what you should do is go back to the app tab and under general, open up the setup wizard and then step through the setup wizard again until you are complete. And then that should bring you back to a pretty general, pretty generic default layout. Now, once you've done this, what I would suggest you do is save this as a default layout. To do that, you're gonna come back up to the settings cog, go into the layouts tab and click on the plus sign, which brings you into the edit window. So you've created a new layer, a new, um, a new layer based on the default settings. And then while you're in this edit window, click on the cog again, and here you have a name. So if you click on the name, you can enter whatever you want. So I'm gonna name this default layout and then hit apply. And now if we go back and have a look at our layouts, we have one here called default layout. So now you can build anything you want and you know you've got a default to jump back to if you're not happy with the stuff that you've created. That's it. I hope this was interesting, educational, entertaining. If it was any of those three things, please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, you can help us out by joining Patreon or you can help us out by doing a super thanks just underneath the video. Anything you do is greatly appreciated. And until we see you next time, thanks for watching here on Quick and Easy Quickies. Bye.